My name is Amanda Hardy and I'm a family nurse practitioner. Um, actually, I've been an RN for about 18, 20 years, but I've been a nurse practitioner for only two and a half. I realized that as a nurse, you see and understand what's wrong with your patients, but you can't actually give them the treatment. And I, I wanted to be able to offer them the treatment. And so I went back to school to kind of take it to the next level. I am so impressed with Williamson Medical Center because every single person I met has been so kind and caring and um, everybody gets along so well and the company as a whole is very family focused they want to make sure everybody has time for their family as well as um, time at work and in the practice I'm working for everybody there is fantastic I'm really excited to join this group because I've never never seen a company quite as impressive as this one. My husband and I are both Nashville natives, actually, and we met in the third grade, which is kind of fun. And we got married in 2002 and moved to Franklin in 2003. We have two sons in middle school now, and um, yeah, we're just, we love it here. We love musicals, so, um, you know, our house kind of sounds like a musical a lot, breaking the song at random times, but um, yeah, kind of us. I like to quilt. I'm a modern quilter when I have time. Um, so, you know, not traditional country stuff. It's very modern and uh, bright, trendy colors and fabrics. So that's kind of fun. At age 41, I decided that I want to learn how to play the trumpet. So I have taken up the trumpet and I'm not great at it yet, but I'm working really hard and I absolutely love it and have a passion for it. So to me, that's pretty unusual. Honestly, I love Latin jazz. Um, I think that all started with one of the musicals I fell in love with, but there's something, when I hear that music, I just, I get so excited and I want to be able to make that music myself. I love how patients tell me at the end of the visit, you know what, you're the first person that's really listened to me and, and heard what I was trying to say and took the time. And to me, that makes me so happy to, um, to give them that time and attention and really listen to what they're trying to say and what contributes to, to their illness. And so that's what I love. I love that kind of feedback. I'm not in a hurry to go anywhere and I want to hear um, their story and where they're coming from. And, um, you know, we, we have a relationship. We, we get to know each other and I think that's a huge part of being able to help them as best as